honoring the life and legacy of the late Lincoln Park singer Chester Bennington. In one week, a one of a kind photo exhibit will, will be displayed right here in Phoenix. And joining us now to tell us all about it is local photographer and musician Jim Laveau. Thanks for being here. No problem. Thanks for having Man, me. Man, what a, I mean, what an interesting life, first of all, personal friend of yours. And that's really how these pictures have come to light and part of the reason why you're able to share them with everybody. Yeah, absolutely. This is a tribute to him, um, you know, for all the stuff that we did together, putting it out there so people can enjoy it the way that we enjoyed working on this together. Wow, this is incredible. And to be able to have this hosted right here yes. at home. Yes. And you guys actually played together in a band. That's how you got to know him? Well, we played a show together back in 2000, uh -huh. uh, about three months before Linkin Park's first record came out. So um, wow, they were still like a brand new baby band. And yeah. so we were really more like peers that turned into friends and you know, his music career took off. That really is incredible. And, and to watch that yeah. must have been wonderful for you as well. Yeah, it's fantastic. Well, what's so cool is that these images that you're going to see at this exhibit, they're captured on and off stage. And they really seem to capture the essence of who he was. Yeah, I know a lot of people, like when they think of him, they think of the, the musician and the Linkin Park stuff, which obviously that stuff touched a lot of people. But like I did charity work with him where he's touring hospitals, you know, with sick children raising thousands of dollars for, for families in need and, um, you know, just so many different things uh, outside the stage stuff. But both of those, you know, elements of his personality are really showcased in these photos and there's so much more to him than, than just being a singer in a band. Well, this one right over here um, in front of the red wall, that's deep. Thank you. That, I mean, you're capturing so much in those eyes right there. Well, you never would have thought when you took these photos um, that they would kind of turn into what they have. Um, this is just me working with my friend. It was always really easy to do. Uh, if anything, it was really hard to get him to be serious because a lot of the time we were joking around and there's lots of smiling and it's kind of hanging out. And success, so much success yeah. surrounding you, having a good old time. Yeah. But you can see there is a depth there. And part of the proceeds of what is gonna happen next week, what many of you will be contributing to, is something that was set up for his wife. It's a benefit. Yeah, fundraiser. her um, Our foundation. Yeah, Talinda Bennington uh, co-founded a charity called 320 Changes Direction uh, after he passed away. And this is like uh, a charity that's out there to raise awareness for mental health. And I'm so glad that these photos and these exhibits um, help you know, get the word out there. Well, we need to talk about it. Yeah, it's a really, really big issue with, yeah, it with is. artists. And um, you know, a lot of the things that we talk about in music and a lot of the things that we do to express ourselves that come from darker places. Absolutely. You know? Well, it, it really touches at the core of all of us. Yeah. Because we're all just people and we're looking for connection. And you talk about the humor so often, we cover up what's really going on with that humor. And that's why this is so important for people to get involved, go out and connect with others. Yeah. Because if it's, if it's not touching you, it's touching somebody you know. We all have yeah. stories. We all have our stuff. Yeah, there's so stuff. So thank you for doing this. Yeah, absolutely. It's just incredible. Thank you. And, and it makes us talk about it too. Yeah. We don't talk about it, we're not going to fix it. All right, so one week away, and we want to give you this information celebrating the life of Chester Bennington, Friday, June 21st. Um, and where is it happening? It's at uh, well, so the Monarchid. Okay which is my favorite art gallery in Roosevelt Row. Oh gosh, so, you gotta get there. Yeah, it's amazing. All right, thank you. Thank you. 